Right set, uh, Sofian Milu in the white judogi. And Eslam Madranov in blue. Madranov putting on uh, some pressure there and Milu stepping off the, uh, the map. Warned about it by the um, by the referee in the middle. This time it's um, Madranov's turn to come under some pressure. Milu needs to turn off there. He really doesn't want to um, be pressured again. Off looking uh, isn't comfortable moving well here. He lost his um, semi final match to Takato Naohisa of Japan. That's what's um, put him in this uh, bronze medal match. Milu, not the, uh, the not the biggest favourite with the French crowd. They reserve their um, their biggest cheers, obviously for Teddy Rinner, but Dimitri Dragan and um, David Laros, they've done their time and have established themselves. Milu's never really been up there with the uh, the big names. Even Benjamin Darbele could do something here if he uh, takes a medal. Both fighters um, worn there. Both fighters penalised. Uh, missed the chance for uh, a Makikomi attack there. to go uh, left-sided for uh, Makikomi. Missed the arm, though. Missed out on the chance of uh, scoring. Went right through with that Sionagi attack and missed out. Two and a half minutes left to go. Halfway. Bit of pressure coming from uh, Mudranov. Nice bit of movement there from the uh, from the Russian. And now Milu making it hard for himself. He picks up a third penalty. Mudranov almost with the pickup. Pressure from Madranov, making things difficult for uh, Milu. Inside the last two minutes now. Madranov with both hands heavily strapped up, looking to go around the waist. To uh, bring off his favorite Uranagi. Here comes Milu again, needing to uh, chase the concert, the, uh, the contest. Minute and a half to go.
Trying to put him up on his hip. And he wasn't really in the... Uh, didn't have the top half of the body where he needed it to be. 